The first sandwich in history was thought to have been created by Rabbi Hillel, who made this meal for Passover. You've got apple and horseradish, which I know sounds disgusting, but it somehow works. But this meal wasn't known as sandwich until John Montagu, the fourth Earl of Sandwich, came along in the 18th century. I am John Montagu, and I invented the sandwich, not you, Subway! You owe me money! Our legendary tale begins in 18th century England, where Montagu was on a 24-hour gambling bender. Losers, losers, I'm the winner. Hey guys, here's your meat, hope you enjoy it. Montagu did not like any interruptions while gambling. It's possible that his impatience led to his invention. Come on, do the next hand. I'm eating you, old chap. Yes, do give us some minutes. I want to win my money back. Oh, you wanted to show up the next hand then. The story suggests that eating and gambling at the same time did not happen in Montague's world. This could be because players' hands were busy dealing with a fork and a knife, or if they ate with their hands, they would get their cards dirty. <sighs> Disgusting. Hey guys, we're gonna I get want you. roast beef between two pieces of bread. Now go! Roast beef between two slices of toasted bread would be the official first sandwich. Hello, I want you to try my sandwich. Okay. It's a little bit dry. No. It was amazing. Montague can now hold his food in one hand while gambling with the other. Now. Time to take every last shilling from both of you blundering bullcars. Which led everybody to say, hey, I'll have the same as sandwich. And the story goes that this is how the lunchtime favorite got its name and why we continue to refer to this meal as sandwich.